The Jordan national football team Arabic, al al is the national team of Jordan and is controlled by the Jordan Football Association, the governing body for football in Jordan. Jordan's home ground, stadium is the Amman International Stadium. Jordan have never qualified for the World Cup Finals, but have appeared three times in the Asian Cup and reached its quarterfinal stage in the 2004 and 2011 editions. Jordan is a two-time champion of the Pan-Arab Games, having won the 1997 and 1999 editions of the tournament. So far, Jordan has hosted the West Asian Football Federation Championship three times in 2000, 2007 and 2010, the Arab Nations Cup once in 1988, and the Pan-Arab Games once in 1999. History The Jordanian national football team's first international match was played in 1953 in Egypt where the team defeated Syria 3-1. The first FIFA World Cup qualifiers Jordan took part in was the 1986 qualifiers, but they are yet to qualify for a World Cup. For the first time in their history, Jordan have qualified for the final round of the FIFA World Cup qualifiers in the 2014 World Cup qualification campaign. The first Jordanian football coach, Mohamed Awad, father of Adnan Awad, to attain achievements for the Jordan national team between 1992 and 1999, when he first helped his country Jordan win the Jordan International Tournament of 1992 and both tournaments of the Pan-Arab Games, starting in 1997 in Beirut, and 1999 in Amman. The Jordan national football team had begun making much more improvements, under the Serbian head coach Branko Smiljanic, who had helped Jordan attain great match results in the first round of the 2002 World Cup qualifiers, but failed to help Jordan qualify for the next round. Braponko also helped Jordan reach the semi-finals of the 2002 Arab Nations Cup and got Jordan to win the fourth place in the 2000 West Asian Football Federation Championship and the second place in the 2004 edition in Syria, but failed to help Jordan win these tournaments. After he resigned from coaching Jordan, the Egyptian Mahmoud El Gohari agreed to take Branko's place as head coach. Under the leadership of El Gohari, the Jordan national team was able to qualify for their first AFC Asian Cup tournament, in China 2004, and helped Jordan reach the quarter-finals of the tournament, but failed to qualify for the semi-finals after losing to Japan in a penalty shootout after the match had ended with extra time in a 1-1 draw. But thanks to El Gohari, the Jordan team reached its highest FIFA world ranking, which was the 37th place in 2004. Just like Serbian Branko, El Gohari also helped Jordan achieve great match results in FIFA World Cup qualifications for 2006 in Jordan's first round, but also failed to help Jordan qualify. In the WAF Championship tournaments of 2004 and 2007, El Gohari helped Jordan win the third place in 2004 and helped Jordan reach the semi-finals in 2007. After coaching Jordan for five out of six matches in the 2007 Asian Cup qualifiers, El Gohari retired as a football coach. The Portuguese Nelo Vingada took over as head coach of Jordan but was not able to help Jordan qualify for the 2007 Asian Cup. Another opportunity to show Vingada's worthiness as head coach came in the 2010 FIFA World Cup qualification campaign. But after failing to help Jordan qualify for the 2010 World Cup, Vingada was able to help Jordan win second place in the 2008 West Asian Football Federation Championship. Next up were the 2011 AFC Asian Cup qualification matches starting from January 2009. After getting off to an awful start by not winning the first two matches of the six, he was sacked by the Jordan Football Association and replaced by the Iraqi Adnan Hamid, one of the best coaches in Asia known for his big successes with his national team Iraq as head coach, as well as Iraq U23 and other Iraq youth teams, and clubs. His first experiences with Jordanian football players took place as he was coaching top Jordan football club Al Fazali from 2006 to 2008 and achieved great results with that team as well. After helping Jordan qualify for their second Asian Cup tournament, Qatar 2011, Hamid began shouting Allahu Akbar for the Jordan national team in September 2010, when they had the 2010 West Asian Football Federation Championship hosted in the country of Jordan. Hamid prepared for that tournament with a couple of friendlies as well as three more to prepare for the Asian Cup tournament in Qatar. 
Just like Mahmoud El Gohari, Hamid also helped Jordan qualify for the quarter finals in the Asian Cup, but failed to progress to the semi finals as they were defeated by Uzbekistan 2 1. Hamid was also got Jordan to win second place in the 2011 Pan Arab Games in Qatar. Hamid helped Jordan finish third in the final round of Asian group qualifying for the 2014 World Cup. He was replaced ahead of the final stages by the Egyptian Hassam Hassan to lead them to the playoff round against Uzbekistan to determine the AFC participant in the Intercontinental Playoff. The games took place on 6 and 10 September 2013. With the two teams still evenly matched at full time in the second leg, Jordan eventually progressed to the Intercontinental Playoff after winning 9-8 on penalties. Unfortunately, the Jordanians missed their very first FIFA World Cup debut after losing 5-0 against the formidable Uruguayan team, after the goalless draw from the second leg. Hassan also helped Jordan to qualify to the 2015 Asian Cup. On 3 September 2014, Ray Wilkins was appointed as the new head coach of Jordan. He led Jordan at the 2015 Asian Cup, where they were eliminated in group stages for the first time after two losses against Iraq and Japan and a win over Palestine. Topic: <laughs> Competitive record. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> FIFA World Cup. Topic AFC Asian Cup Asterisk denotes draws include knockout matches decided on penalty kicks. Topic West Asian Championship record. Topic Arab Nations Cup record. Topic Pan Arab Games record. Topic Asian Games record. Football at the Asian Games has been an under-23 tournament since 2002. Topic Palestine Cup of Nations. Palestine Cup of Nations Topic Results and Fixtures Topic Twenty Eighteen Topic Twenty Nineteen Topic Team Image Topic Home Stadiums The Jordan national team has two home stadiums, and they are Amman International Stadium and King Abdullah II Stadium. The Amman International Stadium was built on 1964 in Amman and opened on 1968. It is the largest stadium in Jordan, it is owned by the Jordanian government and operated by the Higher Council of Youth. It is not only the home stadium of Jordan national football team but also for Al-Fazali. It has a current capacity of 17,619 spectators. Some 12 kilometers away from Amman International Stadium lies the King Abdullah II Stadium. It was built and opened on 1998 in Amman. It has a current capacity of 13,000 spectators. It is not only the home stadium of Jordan national football team but also for Al Wedet. In addition to Jordan home games, the stadiums also hosts other major games in Jordanian football including Jordan Premier League, Jordan FA Cup, Jordan FA Shield, Jordan Super Cup, and it also hosted other tournaments such as 1988 Arab Nations Cup, 1996 Arab Cup Winners' Cup, 1999 Pan Arab Games, 2003 Arab Athletics Championships, 2005 WAF Women's Championship, 2007 Arab Athletics Championships, 2007 WAF Women's 
Women's Championship, 2007 WAF Championship, 2006-07 Arab Champions League Finals, 2007 AFC Cup Finals, 2007 Asian Athletics Championships, 2010 WAF Championship, 2016 FIFA U-17 Women's World Cup and many others. Kit providers Diodora Puma Adidas Jacko Ullsport Adidas Jacko Adidas 2015 to 2018 Joma 2018 Topic Current coaching and technical staff Topic Current squad The following players were called up for the 2019 AFC Asian Cup Preparatory Camp, caps and goals correct as of 20 May 2018 after the game against Cyprus. Recent call-ups The following players have been called to Jordan's national team in the last 12 months. Notasu player suspended INJ player withdrew from the squad due to an injury. Pre preliminary squad, standby. Rhett retired from the national team. WD player withdrew from the squad for non injury related reasons. Topic. Past squads Topic. Records Topic Most capped players Source updated the twelfth of October twenty eighteen. Players in bold are still active at club level. Players with an equal number of caps are ranked in chronological order of reaching the milestone. Topic Top goalscorers. Updated 12 October 2018. Players in bold are still active at club level. Topic: Coaches. Topic: All-time team record. The following table shows Jordan's all-time international record, correct as of the 20th of November 2018. Topic. See also. Jordan National Under-23 Football Team. Jordan National Under-20 Football Team. Jordan National Under-17 Football Team. Jordan Women's National Football Team.